in the year 2019. People are buying vinyl. I love it. Uh, happy Record Store Day, everybody. What an awesome day. And uh, we're thrilled to announce that our record is available today, uh, two weeks prior to it coming out. Thank you. I see some of you already have it. Thank you so much. It, it means a ton to us, and we're stoked to be here. This song's called Continents. Lights on. Okay. Usually it's 1.30 in the morning. I've never seen what you guys look like before. <laughs> you look good, man. You guys all look great. Hey, there's a signed Collective Soul poster kind of covered up by the lady. I'm not sure the lady. The lady? There's a, there's a lady back there. Our new bandmate. Yeah, she's a new bandmate. Anyway, uh, my brother and I, the reason we're playing in a band is because of the band Collective Soul. We're huge fans. We're on the same stage that Collective Soul signed a, a poster back there. And then, the other day on the internet, I 
made fun of them for loving Collective Soul so much, and now I feel terrible. I have no reason to make fun of them. Yeah. Music is about artists coming together. What was I doing? I was dividing everyone. Building walls. It's a big personal breakthrough here for me at Record Store Day. It's all love from here on out. This song's called Right Time. Started 
picking clowns, yeah, they may get in it. Where are we going now? No rain could drop me down. Sometimes I wish I had the guts I had back when I was 17. Nothing could have slowed me down. Sometimes I wish I had the guts I had back when I was 18. Nothing could have slowed me down. Sip of this dogfish head. This stuff is good. They must be a sponsor. I think they, they might be part of today's event. I'm not mad about it. Yeah, right here. Boom. Perfection. One of my favorite scenes in any movie ever is in Wayne's World when he, he's like, I'm not going to bow down to any sponsorships. And then he's in like the Pepsi uniform <laughs> and the, the Pizza Hut. Who can blame him? Places. All of our, that's where we go. Every tour, man, straight to the pee hut. <laughs> Isaac! Yeah? Can you do a shout out to the bridge? Of course. Oh, I can. John Hart and everyone in 909 The Bridge. You guys are like family to us. I know who Gary is out there somewhere. Oh, he's high. I see Michelle over here. I see Michelle. No, seriously, since day one, um, John and his crew have been playing our music literally since the beginning at like and a lot of spins when we really were nothing so thank you uh, for, for doing that for us and as well as other Kansas City artists like it's an insane radio station uh, and we it's just so cool and it's so community focused it's so Kansas City and um, that's why we loved him so yes was that was that all right Dan <laughs>
No, seriously, we love 909 The Bridge uh, uh, on a, like a friendship level too. They're really amazing people. And um, yeah, anyway, we're playing a bunch of songs from our new record, uh, House on Fire, that comes out on the 26th. And all of this is just kind of mind blowing to us because we've always been playing in bands and stuff and doing it pretty independently. So to have a, a record label come on board and do things like this and kind of help us, you know, wrangle all of us into an organized plan has been quite the dream come true for all of us. And to see uh, our album coming out on vinyl. Um, I don't know, has, have any of us had that? Nope. All right. I don't have a record player. <laughs> I've got a shit well, Dan will sell you one today. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, I'll get on that too. Austin and I live together, I use all of his, his vinyl. So your brother has a record player. Yeah, okay. You guys share everything. Literally on tour, they're like, hey man, do you want to you know, split this salad? <laughs> to go watch? All right. That's, that's real life, that's accurate. Uh, this is a brand new song called Heart. We're playing a ton from our record. I hope that's okay. Thank you guys for having me. It's the live debut of Heart, actually. So if it, if it goes wrong, this is the first time we've ever played it. <laughs> Fort Scott people I see out there in the crowd. Yeah. Fort Scott always represents. But that's not just in Kansas City. We'll be in New York 
And Alex and Austin are like, yeah, yeah, about 12 people from Fort Scott are coming outside. <laughs> we scatter, man, we're like a virus. <laughs> so it's called Symmetry Lines. Thanks for hanging out with us. We're keeping it pretty mellow, having fun with you guys. another signed collective soul up there. This place is just filthy with collective soul, signed autograph merchandise. <laughs> I don't think Dan wants to start it. You know there's more than that, right? It's right. They're a virus. Wait, are they really? <laughs> I don't know where. I was like, it all makes sense. Uh, this is the song House on Fire, which is the name of the album.
What is it that you want from me? You can't earn my sympathy. When around the world, I hope to see it was really worth the energy. It's never easy as complexity. At the other hour, you're away from me. It's never easy as complexity. Every other, every other hour, you're away from me. Giving me like, what, what are you doing up there, man? He looks disgusted. <laughs> really, Elvis <laughs> not. Uh, we're gonna do one more for you, uh, but I don't really want to stop. But one, one more for now. This is fun. Um, yeah. So it's our new single. It's called Culture. We're gonna be hanging out after we're done, uh, slinging records and hanging out with all you. I mean, a lot of you are, most of you are good friends and family. So you know, hang out. A lot of family from Port Scott will be hanging out. Right? <laughs> this one's for our buddy Joel. He engineered our album. He's here. He's making sure everything's up to code.
you. We'll play a couple old ones uh, back from uh, 2016, 17. Not that one. We did that one time. Oh, he brings gifts. Oh! Oh! Seriously, thank you so much, Dan. Thank you to uh, everyone at Vinyl Renaissance for treating us so well. They've taken care of us the last two days. That's been incredible. And this is just the icing on the, the collector's little cake basket. <laughs> I'm officially deleting my post about you guys. So we might have Henry Collective Soul Tour 2000. My friend Alex is here and he uh, recently got Chris Daughtry to send a shout out video to me that I thought was organic. <laughs> Turns out Alex may have slipped Daughtry at 20. Probably more. It's a, I shouldn't post that one on the internet though. Daughtry said we might hang out on tour. I doubt that. I don't see that happening. <laughs> Apparently, there is a website where you can pay any celebrity to send you a, a it's, personal it's license. certainly not anyone. Well, it's either Chris Daughtry or Norm MacDonald. <laughs> <laughs> get, get your pick. Norm MacDonald is 175 bucks. I don't know what Chris Daughtry was. No, because okay. Austin and I went ahead and spent the 175 on the Norm. <laughs> That's nice of you guys to do that for me. I can't wait to get that video. I sent it to myself. <laughs> This song is, is an old one. It's Camera Forever. Thanks for hanging out with us.
final reason for having us. Yeah. Wait. Off. Yeah. Nice.